again. Wonderful. All right. Our two homemakers from Tuckahoe and their opponents are unemployed black man and his pretty little wife. <laughs> the Burtons. All right. Now, here's the toss-up question in your category, movie memories. In the 1931 film classic, Public Enemy, James Cagney pushed a grapefruit into the face of a young and unknown actress. Now, if you want to beat the devil, name that actress. May Clark. That's right! <laughs> Now, let's take a look at what you've won. Right, Lyle, chain link fence. How are you gonna receive this beautiful fence? This fence is made They really are giving chain link fence. What kind of prize is chain link fence? Oh, that's one heck of a prize, Walter. Oh my gosh, look at that. With that gift certificate from J.C. Penny, they will want about $3,400 worth of stuff. Yes, that's right, Johnny. Over $3,400 worth of merchandise and $15 in cash, making a grand total of $3,415. <laughs> All right, Maud, Vivian, here's your bonus question, so listen carefully. In the original Tarzan... <laughs> Elmo Lincoln. Right again! <laughs> Congratulations to our two homemakers and really top-notch homemakers, I'll bet. Whoops, that means our time is up. Well, it's too bad, the Burton, Liz Dick, I'm sorry you didn't win. <laughs> but we do have some very nice parting gifts for you, including our Beat the Devil home game with your inflatable host, Lyle Bellamy. How about a fine hand for the Burtons? Really good sport. Thank you. All right, Maud, Vivian, you have just qualified to come back tomorrow and try for the Beelzebub Bonanza. Now, that's a big decision, so take your time. Here's what you could win should you decide to come back. Well, if our contestants do opt to return, they can win this lovely set of luggage, which includes Vivian. two handsome large suitcases Vivian. reinforced with heavy duty chrome. I hate extra this, and I don't want to come back. He won't come back, but Plus at least try to look intelligent. We're on national television. I mean, have a little dignity. In all standard size baggage compartments or under any seat. And all that luggage will come in handy, Lyle, because they'll also be shooting for a 10-day all-expense-paid vacation for four in historic Rome, Italy. Yes, they'll be flown on Angola Airways to beautiful Rome and join the first class accommodations of the charming old girls on the airport in. Well, ladies, what's your decision? Well, thank you very much. Hey, hey! <laughs> We're going to beat the devil! Uh... We're going to beat the devil!